So I know this is a car vlog right now, but this brow pencil, I'm doing my makeup right now, like a very quick glam. You guys, this LA Colors Browie Wowie is amazing. Like I'm actually blown away. Like it makes my eyebrows look really, really good. This is in the color Espresso. I'm obsessed right now. So I just wanted to pop in and share. <laughs> um, it kind of reminds me a little bit of the Anastasia brow definer. It's so good. Like I, I'm really expensive, like what? Just wanted to pop on. Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm doing a car chit chat vlog. Sorry for the noise of my jacket, but I have not done a car vlog in a long time. Like I just looked and it's almost a year. I used to do them so frequent and it was always been a video that I love doing. I love taking guys along with me, although I don't really do anything super exciting and I'm not like vlogging like how a vlogger would vlog, if that makes sense. Do you know what I mean? Like, I feel like I'm not doing the typical vlogging things, but I feel like a car to chat vlog is something that I like. I like just sitting here talking with you guys, and I feel like I haven't done it, so I'm so sorry about that. To chit chat with you guys today, again, not doing much, but I do gotta go to a few errands, and I wanted to just take you guys along. And oh my goodness, I always see these numbers, like 111, 1111, 444. <sighs> It means something. I know it means something. I saw someone post something. But anyway, so welcome to my channel. If you guys are new, then I do makeup videos on here, but I also do car vlogs sometimes. So today's one of those car vlogs. So I hope you guys are all doing well. I figured I would share with you guys like my lip combo because I get so many questions on my Instagram. If you guys don't follow me on my Instagram, it is at blissfulbree underscore. I will have it on the screen for you guys. And like it's always listed in the description. But I always get questions of like what my lip combo is. And I honestly don't change it up that often. Like it's been the same for a while. It's just my go-to staple lip color. And it is the, I don't have the lip liner with me, but it's the NYX lip liner in Nude Beige or Sandstorm. So either one of those. And then the Butter Gloss to top it off in Fortune Cookie is so amazing. But yeah, I always get questions. So it's either one of those and I always like switch it up between the two lip liners, but those are like my staple nude combo. And I get so many questions. I kind of wanted to ask you guys questions or have you guys ask me questions on my Instagram, but I feel like if I posted it now, I wouldn't get a decent amount to like actually share. So I don't think I'm going to do that. Oh, I got a tattoo on my finger. Um, it looks a little dry right now. I need to put lotion on it. Now I have a total of four tattoos. Um, figured I'd share since it's on my finger, but and I'm not like flipping you guys off or anything. But, like three and a half, four weeks ago. So it just says faith, it's on my finger. I don't think you guys can see because the sun is like crazy right now. Um, but yeah, it says faith and I absolutely adore it. I was always wanting to get a finger tattoo and I always like put it off just because everyone always says like they fade. It's the number one one to like go away besides in your mouth, like on your lip, the inside of your lip, I should say. Um, so I was always like hesitant to get it and I was just like, you know what? I'm just gonna get it. So I got it. It was like kind of impulse. And kind of last minute and spur of the moment. I've always known what I wanted to get, like the word. I just didn't know where I want to put it. So yeah, I have one right here. Oh, who else wears hair ties and like forgets to take them off? I always do that. And then I'll look back at a picture and I'm like, why didn't I just take that off? So irritating. Anyway, um, I have one right here that says purpose and you cannot see it. It's a little crooked. It says purpose right here. And then we have the faith. And then everyone always asks me, I guess this is turning into like, my tattoos, <laughs> um, but everyone always asks me like what this one says on my wrist and it says XOXO comma ma with a heart. It's my mom's signature um, from a card. So yeah, I just always wanted to have like her signature on me. So that's what that is. They're watching me vlog great um but yeah i always get questions on what is on my wrist also i did cut my nails i mean a lot of you have noticed obviously in my makeup videos but if you haven't watched them and you're just tuning in for the vlog i always used to have long nails so we trimmed them down to be babies and i really like it i like it a lot better i actually did that for one reason and one reason only which is because of the gym <laughs> and i've been going to the gym 
every single day, well, almost every day for the past two months now, uh, consistently. I did like sign up in September and started going, but now it's been a religious routine for me for the past two months. And I'm actually like really proud of myself that I've been going that long and stuck to a routine because I was never an active one. <laughs> I was never one to go to the gym. I didn't even like gym class in high school. Like I wouldn't do gym. I would come up with every excuse in the book to not do gym. Like I'm really proud of myself that I've been going to the gym. So that's why we cut them down. And I just really couldn't do anything. Like I wanted to be able to make a fist. Um, it's just a lot easier. Like it's just really hard to go to the gym with long nails, although they're super cute and I still like them. I couldn't do anything. So that's why we cut them down, but I'll get into more gym talk later and things like that. So I'm going to go ahead and do my errands right now and I'll check back with you guys in a little bit. I don't really know when or where I'll be. And I don't know if this vlog is going to be fun and entertaining, but like I said before, I'm just taking you guys along with on that note. I'm gonna go, <laughs> I'll see you guys in a few. Also let me know down below if you guys think that I should dye my hair back to the way that I had it a while ago with the blondes at the bottom. I just feel like that's me. I feel like that's like my go-to hair. I loved the fact that I changed it up and did brown. I've been itching to do that for a bit, so I'm happy that I did it and like I still love it. But let me know if you guys think that I should maybe go back because I do love the brown. But like it would be still brown up until here again and then this would fade lightly into that blonde So let me know if you think If you think I should I don't know I'm still like on the fence about it I'm still thinking about it, but it's still a thought that's been in my head for a little bit So that also is a sign to me that like I think it's time to go back I also really need to cut it too. It's getting super long this Sun. Sorry is like blocking it, but it's really really long so I do need to cut it and I don't know, I just like really kind of want to go back. I don't know. Just kind of want people's opinions. I don't know. Sometimes that will get me more confused because I did actually make a poll and ask on Instagram and like half of you said, oh yeah, totally do it. And half of you were like, no, I love the brown. So there's that. Um, but let me know on here your thoughts. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, you wouldn't have seen that. So yeah, make sure to follow me on Instagram because I am there all the time. Definitely let me know your thoughts below what you guys think. out of the post office and picked up a package for my peel box and persona sent over these new lip glosses i am obsessed with their um, matte lip colors so i'm really excited for this this is brand new these i believe launched already yeah, i'm super excited about these they're individually 16 dollars. if you get the bundle that was sent to me like this it'll be 36 dollars. so cool I'm obsessed. I love the name of them too. They're like season one. I love it. So these are also infused with avocado oil and shea butter. And that's also, I believe, what's in the matte lip colors too. That's why it feels so good on the lips. It doesn't feel super drying at all. So I'm really excited. I'm going to open these up right now actually to show you. But hopefully you can see. Coffee, honey, and peach. Yes. I'm really excited about them. The second I saw them post about it, I knew I was going to fall in love. So let me open them up and I'll show you guys exactly what they look like. I think the lighting is probably terrible, but we're just gonna work with it. Yes, uh, you guys already know I am a nude lip color girl, so this one in the middle is probably going to be my go to. A little bit of a shimmer, like hint to them, which I'm fine with. And I love the way the other ones smell, so yes, it smells like vanilla. I love it. So, so good. I'm trying to give the camera to sniff it. You've got to be kidding me. I can't believe I just did that. Wow, <laughs> I just went to go give it to you to smell it. I wish that was a thing. I hope that becomes a thing one day where you can smell what exactly I'm smelling through the camera or computer. Wow. Anyway, this one is the color honey. Oh, yeah, let's go. That's pretty. And I know these watches are gonna be probably be like awful just because I'm in the car. Um, this one is called peach. This girl next to me is looking at me like I'm crazy. And then this one is toffee, so it's a little bit deeper. Yeah, that's like a deeper nude. Really, really pretty. Ooh, mm-hmm. I am into these. Yes, I'm into those. Totally nice. Obsessed. They seriously smell so good. I'm gonna put on honey.
really, really pretty gloss. I hope you can see on this camera and I hope think the lighting is probably all out of whack, so I'm sorry. Okay, that's my little post office adventure right now. I have to run to Whole Foods today. I really want to pick up some more fruit. Not a lot. I think I just want to get raspberries, to be honest, because we already got fruit. Um, if you saw the clip from this morning, I had a little bit of eggs and some strawberries. And yeah, let me know if you guys want to see like a what I eat in a day. Because I really do want to do that for you guys. I get so many questions and it's been a constant request. So I feel like obviously you would want to see that. I don't make these extravagant meals or anything like that. But if you guys do want to still see that, let me know. Kind of just gave you like a little taste of something I would have in the morning. So that was before. But yeah, I just wanted to run to Whole Foods to get like raspberries. She just almost hit my car. Oh, okay. It's time to get back on the road. That sounds like we're on a road trip, oh my god. Guys, right, so I just got back from the post office, which you saw in the other clip of me unboxing this and showing you guys the little swatches of the colors and everything. These are the new Persona lip glosses. I am seriously so obsessed. This is a better view of them and like natural lighting inside. And I am so in love. This is literally the one I'm gravitating towards. Hopefully you guys can see it okay. This one is in the color uh honey and it is so amazing like yes i cannot wait to wear it with a full-on glam like i just kind of tested it on in the car but i cannot wait to wear these they look super stunning and i think they're well worth the price so obsessed with how chic it looks even the packaging just looks super chic so yeah i just wanted to like pop on and show you guys a little other view of it but these are them i guess my allergies started a little bit early this year my eyes keep getting super red and itchy and like that's like the most uncomfortable feeling and also like doesn't look the best too like especially when you're on camera or taking photos or just anything in general like i don't want to have my eyes looking super red so i started using these i they're called the lumify drops and my girl jasmine juicy jazz told me about them and she's like girl you need to try them so i did and i'm obsessed like the whites of my eyes look so bright i only do like one drop in each eye i'm not even a big eye drop person i don't even have contacts or anything like i'm not one to really do that but this seriously helps it makes them so white it takes the redness and itchiness away which is incredible so i figured i'd share um you probably have seen people rave about it but i'm obsessed so if you're looking for eye drops these are definitely the ones to get gotta thank my girl jazz <laughs> This is so good. My girl Kira literally just put me onto this. It is a mango dragon fruit with light ice and coconut milk. I'm obsessed. So, yeah. So good. Go try it. So, I've gotten the original one, like without coconut milk before, but I never really thought to put coconut milk in it. And I know a bunch of people do that, but it's really good. I probably should have got the bigger size. So I'm in the car right now with my friend and we're just headed to the store. Um, I might pop back in a little bit later and bring the camera along, but if not, then I'll probably just end it here with like an outro. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me and make sure to subscribe to my channel if you guys are not already. And I believe that is all for this car chit chat. So I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. So I've never been to home since, and this is pretty new. I am so obsessed right now. Wow. Could this possibly be the new store that I like? Hmm.